For a good breastfeeding, it's important that both position of mother and baby's body have to be in a correct way. The mother should be well sustained and she has to find a comfortable position, which means that she has to find a position that is not going to strain on her neck and back. The baby should be in a comfortable position too. That means that the body must be close to the mom's one and rotate towards her belly. He has to be well sustained and he has to be his airways always free. In the cradle position, it's important that the mother should be sitting comfortably while the baby rests on her forearm. It's important that the baby said must not bend inside the elbow of the mother because the baby can lose his latch with the breast. The mother with the free hand can hold her breast in a C-shaped position. In the cross cradle position, the baby is supported with the forearm which is opposite to the breast that the mother is giving him. It's important that she has to put thumb and index finger on the basis of the ear of the baby so the baby can easily move his head. It's also important that with her free hand she has to sustain his breast in a C-shaped position. The football or rugby position, it's important to drain the external quadrants of the breast and it's a good way to breastfeed twins. In this position, the baby is put under the arm of the mother and his feet are towards her back. It's important that the nose of the baby must be always free and in this position, the latch occurs easily. Breastfeeding benefits are widely recognized from both a nutritional and relational perspective. In the first day of breastfeeding, a mother may need support and assistance. The most crucial part in breastfeeding is to adopt a correct position. In this way, the newborn can suck properly and take sufficient milk. The semi-reclined position is suitable for the first feeds, but it can also be useful later on. It's a simple and natural way in which the newborn can take advantage of its innate skills in reaching the breast. This position is helpful in particular when the baby is learning to attach to the nipple, when he has difficulty in attaching, but also when the mother experiences breast pain or when the breast is tense and full. In this position, the mother places her baby on her chest facing downward, but taking care that the hairways are always clear. In the side lying position, the mother has to lie on her side with her head on a pillow and her arm under the pillow. This position is perfect for nighttime feeds or where the mother is experiencing perineal suture pain. In this position, it's important that the baby's nose is at the same height as the mother's nipple. In this position, it's important that the mother is creating a letter C with her body in order to support the baby during the feeding.